Fisher Friday on the Joe Show. Say it or sing it time. It is uh, the game where the loser sings a song as punishment to whom? Probably you listening. So sorry about that. I don't know how you got roped into it, but that's that's just the way it works. We got uh, categories. We got 10 right answers. We take turns. Uh, Bob will be guessing first. And, um, oh, I suppose we should name the yes. song that we're going to sing. Um, at first, I was thinking about going with uh, Dominic the Donkey, the Christmas Donkey. Oh, but I, I, it was just without the music. That's a tough one to get to because it's got a lot yeah. of a lot of syncopation going on. And so I picked a different animal from the manger, and uh, we're going to do hippopotamus for Christmas. From the manger, from the there was a hippopotamus in the manger. What was there a donkey in the manger? Yes. Okay. Well, then who says there wasn't a hippopotamus? Maybe it was behind uh, some hay. Me. I I say there was not a hippopotamus. Okay, That's fine. Me. Okay, Bob. Bob's making a call. Hey, I don't. Yeah. I'm right. Yeah, you're right once, and I'm right once. <laughs> there we go. All right, Bob, um, your category, prime yes. mates. And uh, what I need to know from you, the top ten things that make somebody good relationship material. So you go on a date with what? them. Do oh, yeah. You, you go on? Because this all fits me, so. This Some, is why. Single the, boy. Somebody, okay, you go on a date, and then you see yes. that they have these qualities that would make them a good life qualities. partner. So what things I'm, I'm gonna fail. would make somebody a good life partner? Are we good? All right, 30 sure. seconds on the clock. Let's go. Uh, uh, good humor. Good uh, uh, cleanliness. Uh, good uh, makeup. Good. Uh, I, I'm going to fail at this. I know I am. You're, you're uh, doing good so far. Really? Okay. Good. Uh, good hairstyle. Uh, good. Uh, uh, you know, they, they shower often. Um, let's see. Good relationship material. Like I say, sense of humor, just the way they carry their on, you know, smartness. Uh, um, Time. Got to be about it. Yeah. Time. You got three, Bob. Well, it's better than I thought I'd do. You got three. You got sense of humor. You got looks. I gave that to you with a makeup thing. Um, and then brains, their smartness. So there we go. Those are the. What did I miss? You missed personality. I was trying to think of that. I uh, you myself missed, into saying that. You, got a, you missed money. Oh. <laughs> you missed sensitivity. Okay. Having a great body. We're just getting shallow there. Um, parenting skills. Yes. Parenting skills. Oh, is it, I don't know how you determine that. Like, unless you're going on a date with somebody that is already a parent, because you don't know. I can tell you this: you don't know how good you're going to be at a parent or how bad until you are a parent, and it changes right. by the hour how good and how bad you are at being a parent. <laughs> uh, chemistry you missed, and manners you missed, but three is pretty respectable, Bob. Okay, things that make a date a good I've mate. Got, I've, I've got a feeling I'm singing this week, but anyway, Joe, are you ready to uh, take a little trip? Take a little trip. I am. Yes, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take you to Hickory Farms. To Hickory Farms. Yes. Do I need to bring the cheese or the meat? <laughs> Aren't um, those the people that know. do the meat? And cheese? I don't know. We'll find out. Coming up here, say it or sing it on the Joe Show. Date a good mate, turning them into a life partner, long term relationship. Bob, yeah. uh, you're talking about Hickory Hickory Farms, Hickory Park, Hickory Farms, not Hickory Park. Okay, and is this in reference to beef and cheese? Um, I I would I would rather not answer that. Oh, okay, all right. Uh, because your list deals with things found in Christmas gift baskets. Oh, I just cut an ad for this sort of thing too, so I might be on point. All right, all right. Uh, Christmas gift baskets go. A charcuterie board. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> uh, but, uh, things you'll find in a Christmas gift basket: a mug. You will find candy canes. You will find chocolates. You will find um, beef and cheese, um, things you'll find in a Christmas gift basket, scarf, slippers, socks. Um, Remember, Hickory things. Farms. Hickory Farms. Find many scar scarves from Hickory Farms. Oh, my goodness. What am I missing here? Uh, 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 You're missing a lot. Oh, my goodness. All right. Are you done? I'm done. Wow. I don't like your Wow. Your wow makes me think yeah, that because you well okay I'm gonna I'm gonna give you two okay because I'm gonna be nice, uh, but you way overthought this. Oh, for real? 
Oh yes, because I mean, you know, like I like I was mentioning before, you know, I don't want to answer because you were actually giving me answers that were answers, and then I didn't say them, did I? And then you didn't say really oh, say them. Goodness. So, okay, you got cheese. Okay, you said cheese enough times that we're giving you that. Now you said meat. Uh huh. Now I can't give you like three separate distinct answers. Oh, I'll, I had to be I'll more give you specific. One. Yeah, there was turkey, ham, and sausage. Aren't those all part of a charcuterie board? I think I had that covered. I have no idea what a charcuterie board. Even, even if you said that, they're separate. It's going to be okay, Joe. You're going to sing. I you feel know. I feel like Bob's lying about his knowledge of charcuterie boards. Is anybody else I, with no, me I on this? I have no this? idea. I've never I've never heard of that. I feel like you're like an every paycheck char- charcuterie board kind of guy. So what? You, can I break it down for you? Please. The most important thing. Because there's other people I'm sure that are out there too that are like, we all know what what you're talking about. We all know what it is. No, they don't. They don't. The most important thing about a charcuterie board is not what's on it, but what it is. Does that make any sense? No. Okay. So the most important part of your charcuterie board is the stuff that you're putting it on, the way that it is plated. Because you can't just take a plate and make a charcuterie board. You have to have like... Uh, like a big giant chunk of wood or a kid's snowboard. It's about the presentation. And then you put your meats and your cheeses and your nuts and your crackers. That that still doesn't say that it's turkey, that it's ham, that it's sausage. You're saying that you could put any type of meat on there. You could put deer meat on there. You could. You're describing. Cheese its and deer meat on a snowboard. Charcuterie. And and, and deer's not on my list. Sorry, deer. Okay. All right. We'll get back. So are you giving me one meat? I'm giving you, I'm giving, you said meat. Okay. So I'm going to give you, I'm being nice. I uh, know, I'm taking it. On, okay, so there's turkey, ham, and sausage. We're combining that into one answer okay. for you. Uh, jam. Oh. Crackers. Man. Nuts. Oh, see, these are all the things in a charcuterie board. Well, I have, <laughs> once again. Okay, uh, no, it's good. We're, it's we're good. talking about separate answers. I know. It's going to be Okay. Do you want me to sing along with you? Uh, if you want. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to. Okay. Uh, nuts, cookies, cheese. You said cheese. Yep. Apples and oranges. Oh, man. Are apples and oranges part of a charcuterie board? Uh, no, no. Normally, you stay okay. away from the fruits and the vegetables. It's more of the hearty stuff. You want the, the, okay. the, the nuts, the figs. <laughs> All right. Uh, here I am singing Hippopotamus for Christmas. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Only a hippopotamus will do. I don't want a doll, no dinky tinker toy. I want a hippopotamus to play with and enjoy. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Only a hippopotamus will do. No crocodiles, no rhinoceroses. I only like hippopotamuses. And hippopotamuses like me too. Woo! You started out strong and finished okay. Yeah, I like most things in life. Uh, Feel Good Friday coming up after 9 on the Joe Show.